And the last, wait until you hear an entire question before answering it, and that way we won't have people speaking over each other at the same time. Is that all okay? Yes, Your Honor. Thank you. Did Dr. Murray provide you with any information as to what Dr. Murray was treating him for? Yes, he did. What did he say? He was treating him for dehydration and exhaustion. And that's all? That's all. Did Dr. Murray ever mention to you having administered propofol to Michael Jackson? No, he did not. Did Conrad Murray ever mention the word propofol to you during the time that you were at the location or in his presence? No, he did not. Did you ever see any sign of life for in Mr. Jackson during the entire time that you were attempting to save him? No, I did not. As a trainee, correct. During these uh, certification um, training. Okay, and when you first got to the Carrollwood residence and observed this person, you described him as being very pale, correct? Correct. Underweight? Yes. Okay, and I believe you previously testified he was so thin that you were able to see his ribs, is that correct? That's correct. Okay. Did this person look real sick to you? He looked like he had a chronic health problem. Okay. And is it fair to say that he had the physical characteristics of someone who had been a drug addict for a long time? That's, that's a hard statement. Please wait until you hear an entire question before you even start to respond. Many of us every day. Good afternoon, sir. Hello, ma'am. What do you do for a living? Uh, I'm a Los Angeles City firefighter paramedic. Did you see anything unusual on the floor when you were in that area assisting Mr. Jackson? Yes, ma'am. Describe what you saw, please. I saw three open vows of lidocaine. Did you ever hear Conrad Murray state that um, he had given Michael Jackson any lidocaine? No, ma'am. Did you ever hear Dr. Murray state that he had given Mr. Jackson propofol? No, ma'am. Prior to Mr. Jackson being transported downstairs, did you see Mr. Excuse me, Dr. Murray do anything with those lidocaine bottles that you had previously testified to us you saw on the floor uh, near, uh, near the bed in Exhibit 22? Yes, ma'am. Tell me what you saw Dr. Murray do with those lidocaine bottles, please. He scooped all three of them up and put them into a black bag 